The most common question that I get is how to buy an aerial hammock. Even though there's this video where I share with you how I install one of my sets, this video I share with you how I use my hammocks at home, and on aerialpractice.com you can find tons of information related to aerial dance. Many of you are still interested to know just exactly how to buy an aerial hammock online. So today, let me take you to go hammock shopping. I'm Eunice. You can find how to practice aerial dance in this channel, Aerial Practice. Some of you may know that I already have a few sets and wondering why would I need a new hammock? Well, they are all slightly different and I use them for different practice. And this time I'm searching for a longer hammock that I can use as a silks to practice aerial silks trick and also to hang it as a longer hammock in a high ceiling space. If you don't have a safe, suitable point for aerial rig yet, you would need to consult a professional rigger or an engineer to tell you exactly what you need to do to set up a safe point for aerial. I will link some information in the description below for you to check out. Now it's time to shop for a new hammock. Let's Google buy aerial hammock and see what search result comes up. If you have been in the community for a while, you will start to get familiar with these names where you can get gears from. For example, I can see Fire Toys, Aerial Living, um, I can see myself, <laughs> and Aerial Essentials. These are, I would say, quite famous in the space. Today, I'm going to take a look at Uplift Active with you for three reasons. They ship everywhere, so you don't have to worry about where you live because most either do Europe or US or Australia. They have a huge inventory, so they don't just have hammock or silks or hoop. They have a lot of things for you to pick from and there's a 10% discount waiting for you to claim. So now we're on their website. Here I can see aerial silk set, aerial hoop as well, and aerial guy hammock. You can also find other items here like a portable rig, especially for those who have trouble installing at home. But today we're going to focus mainly on getting a new aero hammock set. Now that we have gotten a feel of the gear that they offer, the next question is how can you get an aero hammock set just like the one that I have? So let me share with you what I think about when I shop for a hammock. The first one is of course safety, which you can easily achieve if you install your set with the professional help and also get equipment that are made for aerial. And the second thing that I think about is the length of the hammock. The length of the hammock determines how much space you have in the air to work with. To give you my experience, I have tried a four meter set, six meter set, and a nine meter set all in a low ceiling environment. And I can tell you that the four meter set did not work at all. I just didn't have enough fabric to stand in the hammock. And with the nine meter set, I thought it didn't work because I was only hanging it um, at the hip height, which that left a lot of extra fabric on top. And if you do certain moves that the giant balls above might be blocking you, but then later on, I also start hanging the nine meter set way lower, which gives me more fabric space to work with if I'm doing a lot of standing tricks, you can see in some of the videos. And the most common one that I use in the low ceiling environment that I have is the six meter set. And that's why you can see that I have two. I find that six meter is perfect for a low ceiling environment, especially for beginner because it can cover most of the tricks most of the beginner tricks that you can do, you can do a straddle, you can stand on the hammock and also hook the leg, do some splits, aerial handstand. <laughs> My six meter sets really give me a lot of possibility to work with and I felt like I've been advancing so far with them. But the reason I'm looking for a new one is because the more that you practice, the more space that you wish that you have so you can try out different tricks. So now I'm looking for a 10 meter set. The last thing that I think about when purchasing a hammock is the color. After all the hard work, you want to make sure that your color that you're picking matches you, matches the clothes that you have. In that case, you can make beautiful performance or even just 
and taking beautiful aerial photo shoots. Many of you have asked me what kind of material is my fabric made of. And to be honest, this is actually least of my concern when it comes to shopping because you can never tell the material or the quality of it or how it feels in your hand until it actually arrives and gets and when you can touch it. Some of my fabric is stretchier, which I think is better for drops because it's a little bit bouncier. Some of the fabric is less silky, a little bit more rough, which I think is really good for giving you this extra grip strength. Since you can't tell what the fabric is going to feel like, that's why I'm placing my order now and making this video to share with you what the fabric is like once it arrives. Going back to Uplift Active, how am I going to buy the set that I need? Even though I'm buying Ariel hammock, but I am buying a longer hammock, so I can already tell that Ariel yoga hammock set is going to be too short. Here you can see yoga hammock, it's only four meters and five meters. I'm going to buy Ariel silks and then hang them up as hammock. So I finally got the package. It actually came quite fast, especially now I know that it is directly coming from the factory in um, China. I'm actually quite impressed that it's able to ship a 10 meters aerial fabric in such a small package. <laughs> so the funny story is that FedEx called me. I found out that they have translated my address into English from Dutch, so they couldn't actually find my address. That's why you can see all these like Read delivery label. <laughs> now let me see if there's actually a hammock inside. I hope it's not the wrong package or something because it does look way too small. It is an aerial silk. I'm excited to put it up. This is the new hammock. I've ordered this as a set. That means that it also comes with other gears. You can also just buy the fabric itself, but I always like to invest just a little bit more to get the extra gear. That is because you know that I have multiple sets. I use them for different practices, but it would be very annoying if I have to retie my hammock, measure the length every single time I switch them out. So having more gear just really helps me to practice spend more time on practice than switching my gear. This hammock right now is set at the hip height. It's exactly what I would do just as my six meter set. I'm setting it like this just to show you what it looks like if you buy a hammock that is longer than the space that you can use. And you can see there's a lot of weight on top because of the extra hammock. It bothers me from time to time, but it does work and I can use this here and I can also use this in another space. That's why I've invested in this set and I'm looking forward to use it to its full length. The color itself is just beautiful. This gradient color, I feel like it will match any colors of clothes that I have. I can make a lot of beautiful pictures. And then the fabric. You can see that it's not too stretchy. Which means that it's perfect for beginner in my opinion because it also gives a really good grip. The stretchiness in some silks makes me feel like it is a lot harder to control when you move around in the air. So I feel like this set is really great for beginners. I hope this video answers some of your questions and doubts regarding buying a hammock. If you're looking for a new hammock or other aerial equipment, you can get 10% off using the link in the description below. If you need help looking for the perfect hammock, just drop me a comment and we can chat below. Have a wonderful day and see you in next week's videos.